can you solve this geometry challenge? Here's the question. Given this circle, let's draw a segment that passes through the center of the circle and have a measure of 18 units. Now let's draw another segment, measures 12 units, and these two segments are perpendicular to each other. Now the question is so what is the radius, the length of the radius of this circle? So pause this video right now and see if you can answer this question because I will show you the solution in three, two, one. All right, so given this figure, the goal is to find the radius of the circle. And since we want the radius, so let's draw the radius like this. And let's call this as R. Now from here, take note that this length is also radius. So this is also equivalent to R. And now, if this segment measures 18 units, this segment right over here simply equivalent to 18 minus R. And now, using this right triangle, we cannot solve for the value of R. So using the Pythagorean theorem, A squared plus B squared equals C squared, wherein our A is 12, B is 18 minus R, and C, the hypotenuse, is R. Now, solving this equation, 12 squared plus 18 minus R quantity squared equals R squared, we cannot solve for the value of R. So let's simplify. 12 squared is 144. 18 minus R raised to the power of 2 will give us 324 minus 36 R plus R squared. And then bring down R squared. Now subtract R squared on both sides. This is just 0. So our equation becomes 144 plus 324 minus 36 R equals 0. Now add 144 and 324. This will give us 468. Now add 36 R on both sides. And then divide all of this term by 36, we get that the value of R simply equal to 13. And that is the radius of this circle. Therefore, given this figure, then the length of the radius of the circle simply equal to 13 units. And as always, we are done.